हेलो फ्रेंड आई एम नवल यू आर वॉचिंग कोड विथ नवल वेलकम टू जावा सीरीज पार्ट 27 सेवन इन अ लास्ट वीडियो वी सॉ इन कैप्सुलेशन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट एक्सेस मोडिफायर दिस टॉपिक इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज मोस्ट ऑफ इंटरव्यूअर आस्क एक्सप्लेन एक्सेस मोडिफायर विथ अ रियल लाइफ एग्जाम्पल वी विल सी एवरीथिंग वी विल सी एक्सेस मोडिफायर विथ अ रियल लाइफ एग्जाम्पल इन दिस वीडियो सो लेट्स फर्स्ट अंडरस्टैंड डेफिनेशन द एक्सेस मोडिफायर इन जावा स्पेसिफाई द एक्सेसिबिलिटी we can change the access level of field constructor method and class by applying the access modifier or we can simply change accessibility using a access modifier so if you remember if you watch this series keyword video then you saw there we there we have a modifiers total 11 modifiers there we have a public private protected final static abstract and so on in this uh, we have a access modifier four access modifier and other non access modifier we have a total four access modifier and eight non access modifier we will see in this video access modifier this four access modifier so here we have a public private protected and default let's see their scope and where we use and what we get scope so first one is the private we can use a private with variable method and child classes we cannot use private with directly classes we can use with child classes and also we can use with constructor okay and if you define any variable method private then we can access that variable method only within that class we cannot access outside that class then second one we have a default access modifier we can define access default access modifier with a variable method and classes we can define a variable as a default method as a default and class also as a default if we define any variable method class default then we can access those default member only the same package we cannot access outside the package then third one we have a protected we can use a protected with variable method and constructor and if you define any variable method protected then we can use those member only within a package and we can use outside package but only child classes okay only child classes fourth one we have a public public access modifier we can use a public access modifier with variable method class and constructor and if you define any variable method public then we can use those member anywhere anywhere inside your project okay within a class outside a class within a package outside a package within a other package you can use anywhere using this four access modifier we can set accessibility we can set class accessibility we can set a variable accessibility we can set method accessibility we can control everything so let's see one real life example let's consider you have a your own private room okay only you have a that room key that means this room is a your private room no no one can access other than you this room this this one is a private room then you have a your home your all family member can access this home your all family member have a main door key all family member can access this home then we can see this home is a default access this home have a default access then we have a protected if you saw if you if you are living in a society then you saw there we have a common parking there we have a sharing parking there only one security guard can guide you can park your car here you can park your car there like this that means we can say this parking this common parking is a protected okay we can see protected then we have a public the road is a public okay anyone can access anyone can drive their car anyone can drive their bike okay because it's a public property so you can you can explain this example if interviewer ask you real life example give real life example about access modifier okay this one is a very simple example you can you can explain this example so let's open eclipse and perform practical okay i'll simply open eclipse this one is our 27th part for that i'll simply create here one class part 27 part 27 okay let's hit finish button now i'll create one default class here class m test 
okay simply give m test name here we simply define a four variable and each variable we apply different axis okay let's create here first public public string name one okay this first variable is a public now let's set second one default for a default we don't have any keyword i'll simply define here string string name two okay this one is a default then we will define a protected protected string string name three okay then we define private private string name four okay you can see here we simply define a four variable for different different variable and we provide a different different access the first one is the public then second default protected and private let's create this class object and try to access all variable i'll simply create here in our main class i'll simply create here main method and here we create a this class object m test here simply m equal to new new m test okay this one is our object and using this object we will try to access m dot you can see here we got name one name two and name three but here we didn't get name four because we can't access name four outside class only we can access within a class this this name four is a private member that's why we can't access outside class okay now let's apply this modifier on a constructor i'll simply create here first create here default constructor i'll simply call here m test okay m test this one is our default constructor okay you can see no problem we can create a default constructor okay i'll try public constructor public we can access public constructor also now i'll call here protected protected now you can see we can access protected also but if i call here private okay private now you can see it's throwing error because private private member we can't access outside class now here we have a one challenge how can we create how can we access this member also because we can't create a we can't able to create a object this class now in this in this case we can't able to access this member also because here we simply block this constructor here we simply define this constructor private and uh, that's why we, we are not able to create object okay as we saw here we can access we can access outside package also so for that i'll simply create a one package okay let's create here one package let's remove this constructor we saw constructor also we can apply all modifier with constructor also i'll simply remove this that constructor now i'll create here or i can define here protected because you can you can get this code for reference i'll simply create here one more package okay let's create a new package and i'll give this package name demo one hit finish button inside this package i'll create a one class okay i'll create test test one simply test one class as we saw here we can define a class as a public as well as we can define a default but we can if you define a class default then we can't access outside package we can only access within a package but i want to access this class outside package that means we have to define that class as a public class okay let's let's try here to add public modifier now you can see here we define a class public class m test and it's throwing error it's uh, it's showing m test define the its own file when we create a public class that time this class name and file name should be same that's why we, we can't define a two public classes in a one file okay that means we have to create a new file okay i'll simply create here new file okay let's create here class mm test okay i'll give mm test and inside mm test we will simply copy this all member okay let's copy this all member inside this class let's save this okay right now we don't need we already saw this for a constructor can also we can use all modifiers now you can see this class present inside a demo package and i'll create uh, one more class inside a demo and package here we already have created we will simply define here main method okay 
m a i n control space and here we will simply call that class okay what is our class name mm test okay mm test m equal to new mm test this one is our object let's import a package for that i'll simply control shift and it will automatically import it here we saw we can we can access private member only within a class we can access default member only within a same package that means we can only access this package only we can access protected and public member let's try here m dot we can see here we got a okay let's access this m dot a and then m dot okay let's check how many member we have we have a one public member m1 and this third one is a protected member okay now let's see can we access this we can only access this public because this class is not child class of this mm test for making this class child class we have to extend this mm test okay for a, for a package to for a one package to another package if you try to access then only we can access public public member okay now we will simply extend this class mm test extend extends mm test okay now we can try to access here for that first we have to define main method okay let's define here main method okay main method inside a main method we will try and uh, now you can see here here we have a one public and one protected and we can only access public and protected outside outside package within a only child classes we can access protected outside package only within a child classes okay let's try here okay i'll simply define here name 3 equal to and put any random text you can see it's throwing error okay we have to first we have to create this class object because it's not a static member let's create here m equal to new test one and now let's try m dot you can see here we got two member name one and name three okay name one is a public that means we can access anywhere this name one and this name three is a protected we can access protected only child classes okay that's why here we got only two name one and name three now here we saw we can apply this modifiers with a variable with constructor now let's try those very uh, those modifier with method i'll simply define here one method okay i'll i'll define a method inside this mm test okay here here we will define i'll simply define here public public void void mm okay i'll simply give one m1 this is our method i'll simply type here system dot out dot print ln syso and type here m1 method we will try this we will try to access this method inside our test one class because test one extend this mm method okay let's try here m dot m1 okay m1 we can access this m1 okay let's save this let's run this you can see here we got m1 method now let's change this m1 method access i'll simply change here public to default okay now you can you can see here immediately it's throw error because it's not it's not able to access we can't access default outside package and uh, here we define a two packages test one test one present inside a demo package and mm test present inside a demo package okay we can't access default method outside package now we will we will apply this as a protected now you can see immediately error is gone because we can access protected outside package now you can see in this way we can set accessibility for a variable method constructor and we can set the accessibility and we can set control now in this video we saw how can we use the access modifier with variable with constructor with method how can we access how what what access have a public what access have a protected what access have a private we saw everything in this video if you have any concern any doubt then you can ask me in a comment box so in this video that's it we will meet in a next video till that bye bye